Hermione Brigo was barely seven when she witnessed the deaths of six Greek soldiers fighting fascist forces in World War II. They are buried on her farmstead. Now she feels she is fighting a similar authoritarianism and the fight is once again over her land. Brigo owns beachfront property in the Bay of Himara, Albania's most valued resort area, but the government refuses to recognize her title to it. It has marked all the beachfront property in this valley as state-owned and plans to hand it over to developers. I have the title deeds. This land was bought in 1933. My father offered a different piece of land in exchange for it, and because his land was smaller, he also paid 89 gold pieces. The papers are all signed. Now the authorities tell me I'm not the owner. I've submitted the papers to court. They're just holding on to them. These people are crooks. Brigo is one of hundreds of ethnic Greeks who stand to lose 137 hectares of beachfront property stretching down the southern Albanian coast. The government claimed the land last November in a cabinet decision that wasn't ratified by parliament or signed by the president. The Greek minority Omonia party wishes to challenge the cabinet decision in court, but it can't because Albania's court system is crippled by a major shakedown that has seen most Supreme Court and Constitutional Court justices dismissed for corruption. This hiatus in the judiciary could last for years, but development is carrying on. The government is expropriating Greek property at a rate which it has ordained of two and a half dollars per square meter, money which the Greeks aren't even bothering to claim. Deutsche Bank has valued that same property at between 60 and 120 dollars per square meter, putting the total value of land under expropriation at between 800 million and one and a half billion dollars. The government is able to offer such a low rate because it has given developers negotiating leverage. What we have is a government that is plotting on a daily and nightly basis to take away private and public property and then give it to a handful of oligarchs, which are effectively predatory cronies of the government, uh, who are um, uh, taking these properties and developing them in shady deals. The government says it is trying to generate growth for the economy. Our main challenge remains the development of tourism. We have undertaken a big reform for the property titles in Albania, uh, which can guarantee the investors, the foreign investors, that the land they would like to invest their funds is uh, uh, completely in line with the law. The Greeks who died here scored the Second World War's first victory against fascism, pushing Mussolini's forces back through Albania. But in a country without a functioning judiciary and an insufficient balance of power, the arc of justice may outlive Hermione Brigo. John Saropoulos, Al Jazeera, Himara.